video I was just trying out another product that I got from Bushcraft Spain which is rapidly becoming my favorite outdoor shop but probably if you've watched any of my previous videos you would have seen me using some of their gear the tarp certainly is this oilskin tarp a lovely piece of kit that um, I got from from them um, the Basque axes I bought from them and now I'm trying out this lovely leather stool and it's a nice alternative to some of the other options that are on the market. So this is another a good example of what I'm talking about, nice and cheap um, canvas stool, but you know, it is quite bulky uh, for packing into a rucksack. Works well enough, but you know, it's, it is a plastic canvas material um, and quite heavy. So, you know, I quite like the idea of using a nice traditional leather stool. Um, very low profile and you just make up the legs at the camp from some wood you find about. So lovely piece of leather, um, hasn't had much time to mold yet but you know over time this will take a nice shape, um, nice patina and you know a really nice little piece of kit. So one of the advantages obviously it's very slim line, you know just a small piece of leather that's all you're going to be taking into in your rucksack. Um, and then you make up the legs when you get to camp. So a real advantage is, you know, obviously it's nice and traditional, but it, you know, packs really small and flat. When you get to camp, you just need to find a few suitable small sticks, um, bind them together, put some thrapping on, and you're good to go. And you can set it to any height you want. It's another good advantage of a system like this, is that, you know, depending on your height and or how, how you want to be sitting around your campfire, you can adjust just the length of the legs at, at the campsite. Alrighty, so this is a Bushcraft Spain own branded product. It's something they've made and um, developed themselves. Um, I mean, it's a fairly traditional seat. Um, many people make this kind of thing, but this has been very nicely made, nice piece of thick leather, nice patterning, lovely stitching. So definitely recommend the Bushcraft Spain if you're interested in something like this. One consideration of leather in a wet climate, um, you know, there's a tendency to develop mold. Um, but as I say, it's, it's rugged, it's a nice thick piece. Um, you know, and if you keep it well maintained, it should last a long time. You know, canvas has an advantage. Um, it's, it's, well, it, without the metal, it's quite a lot lighter. So you could get in the canvas equivalent of something like this. But with the metal legs, you're carrying a lot of extra weight. And if you just make the legs on site, it's, it's a lot lighter. Um, canvas is probably better in the wet. But the one um, disadvantage of something like canvas is around a fire, you know, a spark can go in, could burn it quite quickly, whereas leather is going to be pretty robust. So there's pros and cons of both systems. Um, you know, I really like this. It's nice and slim line. Um, looks really nice and will develop a nice patina over time. I mean, the cheapest option is you could just sit on a stump, but uh, if you like traditional gear um, and you want something pretty slim line and light, then, you know, this is definitely something worth thinking about. And um, it's, it's a really nice product. So I hope you find that interesting and thanks for watching.